What's up, y'all? It's Cody Flame, Flame Cody, however you want to pronounce Make sure the gas ain't bad. I know I got this gas about two months ago. Gas can usually stay stored for about three months, so this gas should be okay. Not too much gas, because you might have to pour it out just enough. You want to get this back on here. You want to get the gas cap back on there. It's a little breather valve right there. And then you want to make sure to choke on, choke down. <clears throat> you want to turn the gas on right here. As straight of a line as you can get it. You want to turn the gas on here. As you can see it's on. Well, it was off, now it's on. Make sure that gas get flowing through here. See some gas flowing. Put that filter with a little bit of gas in it. I'm just inspecting the exhaust right here. It don't seem to be too tight. Keep the choke down for now. Bring it up a little bit. Try to start it. Let's give it a few pumps. Two, three. Get the throttle a little bit so it can fill up the... Hitting the throttle will basically... Okay, throttle still works. Make sure everything is copostatic with this cable here. It seemed to be up just a little bit too far. One of the best things to use is this right here. I can move it up like this. Push it. Make sure this spinning here. Next, another thing you want to do is make sure this thing is, this part is in all the way right here. I'm not exactly sure what this is called. I just know how everything works. Let's pull it out. Give it one long one. Let it go in. One long one. Let it go in and give it a rip. This one will not come on. I think it's got something to do with her spark plug. See, we got an on position. Let's cut the gas off and cut the gas off. All right, push that down. Come back and inspect this spark plug right here. After inspecting the spark plug, we're going to do the carburetor next. Let's get this spark plug off of there. Okay guys, I'm back. This right here is a 5 ace tool. It's a specialty tool for spark plugs but it won't do us any justice on this because it doesn't fit the spark plugs on these dirt bikes had a bigger a bigger uh parameter around it so we're gonna have to go with a 19 millimeter to get this thing off of here righty tighty lefty loosey and i can hand twist it out just to see what kind of condition this spark plug is in Usually these things are in pretty good shape, but this one it smells extremely like gas. So I think this project will have to be postponed to another day. Because I have to get a different spark plug. And uh, that is what's needed to complete this. So I'm going to basically have to take this one in and then... Uh, get a new one you always want to hand thread these and twist these things because uh these are fine threads it's easy to strip the threads 
if I keep twisting it, it won't need nothing but a pull starter. A new pull starter. I can turn the gas back on, put the choke back on, get his carburetor. A few taps under here. Sometimes the floater gets stuck. Then I can uh, try to put a little bit of space between these two. I want to clip that right there. I'm going to clip this right here. Guys, I want to come down here. Open this up just a little bit. Maybe the gas isn't, any gas isn't coming in. Make sure the ignition coil is down. Couple pumps. Now, let's try to get it going. Okay, in order to avoid mounting another pull starter, let's check out the carburetor now. So now we want to make sure that's open. UL2, sit about right there. You just want to make sure that this is working. It's supposed to go up and down. Sometimes it doesn't the way that it's supposed to. Don't want to drop the screw again. So this time, I'm going to get it in there. Like that. Only limitation it come to working on this kind of stuff is the limitations that you put on yourself, man. You want to get this other screw here. And you want to take the same technique and try to get it in there like this. Twist this one in too as well. Make sure the gas gets set on there. I'm gonna loosen this one up. Make sure the gas gets set. Then you wanna twist it into place. Doesn't need to be too tight. Tight enough for the gasket to seal. Tighten this one. All the way down again. So, put a little soap in there just to get all of that gas out of there that you spilled in there. Put some more gas in here. If this doesn't fix the problem, then we know. Yeah, we need a new spark plug gas. Now, choke down, gas open, gas is on. Put our foot on it. Kickstand up. Put our foot on it. Give it a nice pull start. Make sure the cable throttle working properly. All right, now. Spark plug, guys. We can loosen this up some more. It doesn't come open this time. Come on this time. Then, yep, it's a spark plug. These spark plugs that come on these is really cheap, so they give out easily. It's a spark plug, guys. So I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow with the rest of these problems. I think it's a spark plug. I'm gonna try that tomorrow. I'm gonna try some fresh gas maybe, but until next time, 
Peace out. I'm going to see you on the next video.